Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, 77 Cuddy, black with the purple strip. What's good, Ravens fam? So, this is video is from question from comments. I only got one question from the comments. And that question, this might be it might be a little short video. Um, but that question is from Donovan Sales 2070. Hey Raven C, what do you think about the backup quarterback position? I want Josh Johnson to win that position. Now with that, um I know some people probably like, man, you just hate um that backup position, that is a good question because that backup position, in my opinion, is very interesting because you have Tyler Huntley, you have Josh Johnson, as you stated, and you have Anthony Brown. Now, Josh, how old is Josh? Let me see. Let me see how old is Josh. Josh Johnson is up there, I believe. Uh, where is 37 years old. You're 137 years old when you fought Joe Lewis. Okay, so... Um, he's 37 years old, but he knows Todd Smunkin's offense. Now, Todd Munkin's offense is a lot of passing. Lamar loves that about that. Anthony Brown is a good, great, good, good, pretty good passer. He can throw it down the field. We know Josh Johnson can throw it down the field. Then that leaves Tyler Huntley. Now... Tyler Huntley really can't throw like that. We know he throw his five yards, sometimes ten. But down the field, that accuracy is pretty bad. Him as a starter, I believe it's like three and six, something like that. He has more interceptions than he has touchdowns, I believe. And then I read something that said Tyler Huntley, I think he's supposed to get like three mil. Something like that. I'm not 100% sure. I think it was three mil. Let me see if I can find it. But Josh Johnson, we know, is not going to get that much. I believe uh, what I read was, I'm going to try to find it too. Because it just popped in my head. I believe too that. There it is. I believe too that. With um, yeah, here it is. Okay, Tyler Huntley would cost two point six million, not three million. Josh Johnson is one million. Anthony Brown is eight hundred and seventy thousand. If they keep Johnson and Huntley, that would be three point seventy four million against the cap. If, but if they keep Johnson and Brown. It would be slightly under two million. Anthony Anthony Brown is a lot younger. He can throw. You can try to develop him. As you developed Huntley with the Greg Roman, that was his that was his type of offense, really. Not that much throwing, just running. Now that's where it comes to question. Are you gonna save the money? You gonna let Huntley go. Nobody's going to. I don't, I don't think nobody will want to trade for Huntley. Throughout the whole NFL, I cannot think of a team. Because so many people are passing that right now. And Huntley, is, he he don't have that cannon. And a lot of you all know. I can't stand the way he. Let me. What, this Like this with his arm when he throws. All of that. Get hit. Fumble. So, I don't know. I don't know. I know some people, he almost beat the Bengals. That was the defense playing extremely good against that defense, shutting them down. But that's another topic for another day. But my backup quarterback, I'll put Josh Johnson, QB2, QB3. I'll put Brown. I'll let Huntley hit the market. Have fun. Hurrah, hurrah. 
They might have him try to play as a Lamar Jackson with whoever picks him up. But that would be my mind. Because Anthony Brown, he got a cannon, and you can develop him for this type of offense. Todd Munkin. Josh Johnson played for Todd Munkin the offense before, so he can he can teach Lamar the um help him with the scheme if he have any questions. And he can help develop um, Anthony Brown. So that is my my QB selection. So you all tell me what you all a QB selection for. Thank you, Donovan, um, for the question. If anyone else have any questions, put them in the comments so I can put them on question from comments. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the share. Everybody stay safe. God bless.